I want to be in the dark by myself alone and I want to be unconscious. I think that um, my ADHD and depression anxiety are all definitely directly related to my childhood. I moved to Ohio when I was eight years old because my father had passed away. He had uh, cancer and how my mom took it afterwards. Started to have a really bad drinking problem and started taking prescription medications all the time. As a kid, I was always afraid something was gonna happen. I've always been anxious. I mean, the depression didn't s seem to start until I was like in my teens. Like our sophomore year, you definitely hit a, a crisis point there where I came close to hospitalizing her for suicidal ideation. You know, the, the hardest part was just feeling so helpless, like nothing we could do would really help. You know, and depression is, is like this for anyone. I'm sure it kind of pulls everybody in, you know, like a kind of a, a black hole. It's something that's real that people don't understand. It's like a monster, like something in the back of your head. It's, yeah. it's not fun to talk about, and people don't talk about it. The more we can talk about it, the less people will feel alone. Everything changed when I got to Ohio, except that one of the first things that we did was get me back into the music program. When I'm playing violin, like, everything just kind of goes away. It's a form of therapy. I know that I'm strong 